Hello Uniplot community. Today we are going to work with the data brother and the edit option. I want to show you how to classify and split your files and then sort the information so that you can reorder the file you input in Uniplot. Today we will work with some data that is organized in phase. Let me show you. Okay, so this is the file. We have two vectors. I'll go to the data brother option. One which is called phase test, which tells you in which phase you are, and one which is in this case the rotational speed. What I would like to do is to separate the phases to plot different curves for different phases. Let me show you otherwise how it looks. If I create a new document, this is what I have, which is not really interesting for me for the moment because I cannot compare the faces. So I will go to the data brother again and I will use some options that are offered to me in the data brother. I right click in the yellow area, whatever the place, then I go to more function and I will classify the data. Then you have the option to choose which variable you want to use to classify your data. In this case, I will use the phase test. You can see that here you have the list of available channel to do so. So let's select phase test and click on OK. Then Uniplot will create a new column for which each phase will receive an index. Let's check phase 7. You can see the index 7. Phase 7, index 7. Then once it's done, you right click, more function, and I will split in files. It will create one file per phase index. I click on OK, and this is done. I can see in the log that it's done. I will close that, and now I will open the files that I have been splitted by clicking on File, Import Data. I will go to the place where I store my NC file and you can see here one file per phase. So the first four phase or first three phase are just have just one point, so we'll take the first one. Okay, we can now see my rotational speed for this file. I will go inside and I can see the column I was expecting to see. Now let me import the rest of file by going to add channels from file. We have seen in the past that we can concatenate files, but that's time-wise. Here we're gonna add channels. So I selected the 4-4, so we're gonna take from 5 to 8. And then you can see that one column has been created per file, and Uniplot just concatenates 0, 1, 2, 3 to the channel, not to have similar names. And here, especially the most important part, we can see the rotational speed. I will close and now I can properly plot my curves. So let me do that here. And then I will add the rest of curves. Uniplot asks me whether I want to delete the first one. No, no, I want to add it. Let's do another scale. And the last one. We have seen how to classify a file with respect to one channel, either a numerical channel or a string channel, then that we can split it in function of this new index we created, and then how to concatenate those files into one so that we can work with it in an easier way. One last function for today. Let's say I want to sort a whole file in function of one channel. To do so, let's use the file I was using for this tutorial. Okay, I have my rotational speed. I will click on Edit. You see that for the moment, the, the information is not sorted. It's sorted in function of the phase. I will right click, go to More Function and Sort Data and I'm asking to sort in function of the rotational speed. I click on OK, and it has been done. 
now the whole file is being sorted I close then let's make a new page and I will do a 1D diagram and you can see that the information is sorted we learn to classify, split and sort files I hope this helps you to prepare your data files to work in Uniplot this was Adrian speaking. Thank you for your time. Any question, do not hesitate to write at support at uniplot.de where our team of experts will answer all your questions.